And now an aid to humanity happening, uh, an aid to humanity by the Church of Christ in Quebec, Canada. Live with us at the scene is Sabir Mufti. Hello, Sabir. Oh, bonjour. Bonjour, Sabir. Thank you. Oui, on est ici au Gatineau, Québec, au Canada, à peu près 10 minutes, euh, de notre uh, capitale nationale uh, du Canada, uh, Ottawa. Uh, we are here in Gatineau, Quebec, Canada. We're, we're the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation, with the assistance of the Iglesia de Cristo Church of Christ members, are conducting an Aid to Humanity event, provi providing help to those in surrounding shelters. The event will showcase talents from the Iglesia de Cristo members and remarks from church and government officials. This event continues the church's global campaign to help those in need. And with us today, we have uh, the District Minister of Ottawa, the District of Ottawa, uh, J Mr. J.R. Razon. Uh, Mr. Mr. J.R. Razon, thank, thank, thank you for, you for joining, joining us today. today. If, if you, you could, could uh, tell, tell us a little, a little bit, bit about, about this, this event, event and... Um, um, so give, give us some, some background, background, some information, and uh, what's, what's, what's happening, happening today. today. Yes, uh, we are uh, preparing for an, uh, a big event because this is uh, in line with uh, what we are doing in the foundation, the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation, which is the charitable arm of the church. And the volunteers have been preparing these care packages so that we can help our fellow men here in the Gatineau community. And... Many of them uh, could not sleep. And what we've seen today is outpouring of love. And we truly believe that this kind of love will transcend through these kinds of humanitarian works, which is why if we're eager to do that, it's not difficult to help them if we have the capability to do so. Now, now the church has been doing many of these events globally. Um, how, how, how does, does that, that impact, impact what's, what's happening, happening in this world? world? Well, we are aware that uh, in every corner of the globe, we are fighting poverty. Even in countries that people may view as a powerful and influential country, but due to the global pandemic and the social unrest, it has really aggravated the uh, uh, economy presently. So wherever we are, People are really in need of help. And that's why, even in this part of the world, we will help through our leadership of our executive minister in the church, uh, Brother Eduardo V. Manalo. And it is his initiative, which is why uh, the members and volunteers are inspired to uh, fulfill this noble work of loving our fellow men through these generous uh, care packages. Wonderful. Thank you, Mr. Razon. I uh, appreciate your time today, and we hope today that it would be a, a fantastic event. Now, now joining us once again uh, uh, with us is one of the directors of the Moisson Utahwe, which is one of the shelters here in Quebec, in Gatineau, Quebec, uh, Miss uh, Diane Dupont. Right. Hello, Miss Dupont. Uh, thank you for joining us. Could you tell us a little bit about what's going on again? Um, your thoughts about today's event and, and how this is helping your dear shelter. Moisson Tewe is actually the regional food bank for the Utahwe region. So we cover uh, 30,000 square kilometers of territory and support 49 organisms, food banks, shelters across the region. So to see this spread helping us, helping people is just wonderful and I'd really, really like to thank Brother Eduardo Manalo and Church of Christ for doing this. It's fantastic. Wonderful. We thank you so much for coming today, and uh, we appreciate your time. Thank you very much. Have a good day. Uh, and now uh, one of the uh, organizers as well, uh, one of the ministers of the Church of Christ helping the district uh, is uh, uh, Roland, uh, Brother Roland Andrade. Hi, uh, Mr. Rowland. Hello, good morning. Uh, could you tell us a little bit again about what's happening today, your, your involvement uh, in this event? Yes, um, we're conducting today an ATMAT project uh, spearheaded by the volunteers of Felix Y. Manal Foundation and, of course, by the members of the Iglesia Ni Cristo or Church of Christ. 
and um, I understand there's about 15 shelters that are coming. Do you know how, approximately how many people are coming today? We are expecting hundreds of uh, recipients who would come from four uh, significant shelters, and uh, we are here for them and to help them support them in their needs because in the church and in the Felix Y. Manalo Foundation, we are advocates of uh, outreach initiatives, especially now that many people are in need. And of course, they're victimized by the current pandemic. We are here for them. Wonderful. Thank you so much for your time today. Thank you. And uh, we've got one of the hosts today, who's also been part of the organization, uh, Mr. Jean-Marc Chatrain. Mr. Chatrain, how are you today? Bonjour, bonjour. Bonjour. I'm great. Thank uh, you very much. Wonderful. Tell us a little bit about why. Well, I see it's raining a little bit, but that's okay. Tell us a little bit about what this is happening, or this event happening today, and your involvement. So I will be the host today for this event. Uh, we're very excited. Even though it's just a little rain, it's okay. Everything will go smooth. Uh, we're here to uh, give uh, hope and give care package to the community with what's happening right now with the COVID-19 and all that. Lately, uh, a lot of the population have been hit harder than uh, some, some other place. So that's why we're here, to give them hope, to give them uh, our love, and to show them that uh, we're, we're here to support them. What kind of program are, can people expect today? Oh, we have dancing, we have singing, we have uh, a lot of uh, special performance in store for them. Wonderful. Well, thank you for your time. Thank you very Take much. Care. And uh, that one of the another ministers in the District of Ottawa, uh, Mr. Lenito De Aro. So, yes. Hello, Mr. Lenito yeah. De Aro. How are you? Good. Today? We're excited in this activity. Wonderful. Tell us a little bit about what's going on. Yeah, uh, for now, uh, we learn from the church administration through the leadership of our beloved executive minister, Brother Eduardo V. Manalo, whenever we can do good to others. That's why we conduct this uh, Aid to Humanity activity to help uh, especially the needy people and also to extend our love for them. Well, thank you so much for being here and thank you for your time. And now we have... Uh, one of the main organizers of this event uh, worked tirelessly, as I uh, understood, Mr. Andre Lajoie. Good morning, Mr. Oh, good morning. How are you this morning? Oh, thank you. How are you? I'm very good. I'm very so, happy to be here today. Tell morning. us uh, your involvement today. Well, my involvement was to contact the shelters, the uh, soup kitchens, the uh, the members of the parliament, uh, many people, in fact, that uh, to be able to uh, join us in this uh, celebration of uh, the foundation of Eduardo Vimanalo. I'm very glad to be here this morning. Wonderful. And we've got some participants coming already. Uh, I heard. Uh, who who else is going to be here? You know. Well, we invited uh, some uh, members of the parliament and uh, the MPs of uh, Hall Elmer, uh, Greg Fergus and uh, Stephen McKinnon from Gatno. The, we also invited the uh, Prime Minister, uh, Justin Trudeau, which we're still waiting to find out if they're coming, but uh, with the weather, we hope that it's better cooperate today. So, uh, yes, and we have also members of the directors of uh, many many shelters of uh, Gatno, Hall, Elmer. Wonderful. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you very much, Abir. Thank, Thank you. Oh, well, that's... Uh, well, we're here in Gatineau, Quebec. Even though it's raining, we're still pushing forward for this wonderful event uh, for Eagle News International. Sabir Mufti, we live in interesting time. Sabir, and I know that you're going to have a very interesting and uh, fantastic event over there. You take care, and uh, we'll be uh, looking forward to the developments on that story. Thank you very much, Sabir. Thank you, Thank you Alma. And the news.